This whole quarantine thing is costing me some physical labor that I'm really not used to, nor do I care for. Uh, today I gotta do some gardening. Gardening. It's not just gardening, I gotta plant some vegetables, but actually before I do that, I have to get the garden ready, which means it's got some big weeds, it's got some whatever, and I gotta get rid of that. I don't know if I'm gonna rototill the garden today, but I do have to get a prep for the rototill. <sighs> this whole quarantine thing's gotta go. This is cutting into my fishing time real bad. I'm gonna tell you, I don't like it at all. By the way, I went to the post office today. I just come from the post office. People are lined up there like they're lined up at a liquor store. Seriously, it's a post office. For those of you that don't know, we don't get our mail delivered. We do have to go to the post office to get it. Anyway, I'm gonna grab myself coffee on the way home. I'm gonna fire up the weed whacker, weed eater. I'm gonna fire up that weed thing and I'm gonna get the weeds cut out of the garden, Get. A down the best I can and she's gonna make me go get a rototiller but I do need to make a run to Windsor to get some coffee she's not gonna let me do that either it just sucks Today is one of the best days we've had weather-wise in forever. And I'm not working today. And I'm thinking the crap you're running, it's warm. We're out here in t-shirts, sun shining. I'm going to run a rototiller. All right, I'm telling you, this whole quarantine thing is a conspiracy by women. Women. Yes, you. Conspiracy by women. I started out just digging a nice little edge, as you saw, around the... You know where the garden's gonna go now huh, now oh honey it's gonna rain for the next couple of days you might want to go get a rototiller which is a rototiller at the rental place because I don't have one oh while you're there you might want to rent a chainsaw because again I don't have a chainsaw because I got a pile of wood next to the shed from the tree that fell if I can find a video, I'll show you the tree. But So now, I'm going from digging the outline of the garden to doing the garden to, 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 we'll go with to, cutting the wood. Now, tell me, y'all don't agree, guys. Y'all, tell me you don't agree. It's a female conspiracy. Female conspiracy. Damn! Conspiracies, I'm telling you. Conspiracies. Okay, so... Sorry, it's dark there. So initially, I went uptown to get a chainsaw and a rototiller. 
guy was closed. I like to keep the money locally. Although, I did call Chatham, and I spoke to a company in Chatham. They did have one, a chainsaw and a rototiller. So I was on my way to Chatham. I thought, I'll give this guy a call. Turns out, he's not working at the shop. He's working at his house. Saved me the ride to Chatham. Anyway, I already got most of the logs cut up. I got a little bit more to do. I guess he didn't have the uh, rototiller on hand when I got there. So when I take this back, the chainsaw that is, he should have the rototiller there. But let's cut some more wood. <laughs> I think I am working just way too hard. All that wood over here beside the shed, it's uh, gonna take a log splitter to split that up. I do have an ax, but I'm not really feeling that energetic. But I do have a big pile of wood to stack up right here. And uh, I'm working my butt off. I think she should cook me a steak tonight. I'm gonna put that out there. I'll let you know how that works out. Anyway, I'm gonna get this wood stacked up. I think that's it for the chainsaw. Alright guys, I got three potential stools. Two are going to be good. Uh, this one right here, it's a little boogered up, so I don't know that we're going to be able to make something out of that, but I'm just going to cut the knobs off these ones here and see what they look like. Kind of make it feel like a real campfire in the middle of town. Stand by. All right, well there you go. I did manage to keep that uh, little one over there, kind of still on an angle. If you have a few drinks, you can straighten the angle up. When the uh, warden gets back home, I'm gonna load this stuff up, take it back, and see if he's got the rototiller ready. If he does, a rototiller in the garden. I can hardly wait. All right, we are back home with the rototiller. Uh, this really isn't a rototiller. Have a look. I guess it's just some great big machine with blades on it and cutters. Look at this. So this thing is small, light, but this is all I got to dig up. But on the front, it's got those blades. Let's see what happens. All right, well, here you have it. <laughs> that little patch of grass. Took about two and a half hours with that. I'm gonna call it a rototiller. I'd recommend never buying one, never. The ground wasn't that hard, but there's just no weight to the machine to dig into the ground. I still don't think it's right, but we're going to go with it anyways. i got to run that machine back, and then uh, I have a nap. Guys, I wasn't kidding when I said I needed to have a nap. I actually went in the house and fell asleep. This is the next day. So I'm going to show you what I got finished. So there we got the wood all stacked up and cut. Three stools. And last but not least... The garden. All right, now I can tell you that's 
Probably I dug down about two inches. I'm gonna have to go over the whole thing with a shovel, break it all up, do it by hand. So I'm not gonna bother go running another rototiller. And by the way, that was not a rototiller I had. I don't know what it's called, but don't ever buy one. Anyway, this is where our fresh vegetables are gonna be going. That's where we're gonna have our campfires. As soon as they lift the ban here in Chatham Kent. I got, like I said, I got done working last night. Went in the house, had something to eat. And no, she did not cook me my steak. I was not impressed. Lay down on the couch. I wake up today. Realize, I didn't record an outro, so here it is. We have the garden ready, and all we gotta do now is put the plants in, and we got some fresh vegetables, which is what the whole goal is about. Anyway, that is all I got for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed that. I'll see you on the next one. Later.